Hey, I've got a little interesting development today. Uh, I went ahead and checked Fearless Revolution, which is a site that people use to distribute cheat engine tables. And apparently someone on there made a, uh, a code that allows you to use ground special moves on the air. Now, if you've ever played any of the sky types in this game, you know one of the biggest problems with them is that uh, a lot of their best moves you can't use in the air, which kind of defeats the purpose of, <laughs> of going into full force burst. There, there are a lot of characters, uh, Marco and Sanji are probably the biggest offenders. Uh, a lot of Sanji's Muso attacks uh, you can't use in the air, and then Marco's uh, his strongest one you can't use in the air either. Uh, Sanji can't even activate full force burst in the air, which is kind of backwards. So let's go ahead and test it out right now. And now for the purpose of testing, I have uh, unlimited special moves on. Let's see, there we go, I activated Skywalk in midair. There we go. <laughs> That's so satisfying. That that right there makes him uh, a much better character, being able to do that in midair. I really don't know what they were thinking with uh, making characters that are designed to be played in the air and then not letting you use a lot of their best moves. The hitbox on this move, what is it called, extra hachi sash or whatever, is actually quite, quite generous, so it works. See if that works. That uh, kind of works. All right, so let's go ahead and try Marco now. Marco is one of the other characters who's heavily limited by uh, a lot of his best stuff not being aerial enabled. Let's go ahead and do a quick new world map. I don't think the hitboxes are actually adjusted, so some things will work and some won't. It's going to take a lot of testing, probably more than I can actually do by myself to do that, but let's go ahead and do some quick testing here. So Marco's actually pretty privileged in this game. He actually does have a lot of his, uh, his stuff aerial enabled, but this move, which is like his best Muso, you can't use. I think he's all ready to go, actually.
<laughs> it just seems like the hitbox doesn't work on certain moves, unfortunately. That's something they'll probably have to fix on their own later on. Alright, Sanji seems like the, uh, the winner of this mod. Let's see if this actually hits anybody. No. <laughs> Basically did a whole lot of nothing. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, try some of Sanji's moves then. I guess whether the move actually hits or not depends on how the game, how that actual move is coded on a case-to-case -case basis. And like, you see him doing it in the air, but there's no actual hitbox attached to it. Uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and try this out. Oh, that actually hit something. <laughs> That's cool. I wonder how high you can be up and still have that actually have a hitbox. Oh, that's, that's actually a pretty big improvement for him. <laughs> it's like 80% uh, of the way there towards making Sanji a playable character. If he didn't have his gimmick, I think he'd this he would be the, uh, the biggest winner of this mod so far. Let's uh, check out another one of his Muso attacks. I'm kind of doing this uh, on the fly here. Okay, so these are aerial enabled, so they don't matter. I already just tried this one. Try this one now. I don't even have them maxed out because you can't use them in the air. Being able to use Skywalk in the air and then ha have extra Musos to work with is pretty good. Well, that definitely worked. That hit him too, way up there. <laughs> awesome. Sanji seriously needs some help in this game. This is uh this is close to fixing him, but not quite. Alright, if I'm up this high, does this actually hit them? That's what I'm wondering. Sure does. <laughs> awesome. Um, Sanji's almost, uh, it's almost a playable character. Not quite. Alright, let's see if I can test one more. I have, like, cheats on right now to have unlimited specials, so <laughs> I think it's worth doing a, a full run. Let's just uh, take some characters for test drives. Uh, I don't know who else would really benefit from it the most. Sanji definitely, as we can see. Uh, Luchi's quite privileged because pretty much all his stuff is aerial enabled. 
all the Power Ranger people, same deal. Uh, I would say Zara would benefit from it, but his moves come out so fast, so slow, that he would have to really uh, work with it to do that. Luffy might actually benefit. Let's, let's go ahead and try him. This will be the, uh, the last live test. Let's see here. Let's try the explosive fart move. That might actually work well for him. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> I want to see if the explosive fart actually has a, uh, a hitbox. Oops. No, it does. Uh, seems like the hitbox on that is actually quite generous. Kind of works, kind of doesn't at the same time. Anyway, that's going to be the end of my uh, devious science experiments for now. I'll go ahead and I'll put the link in the description. I think you need the latest cheat engine to use some of these codes. Like if you want to equip all the passives at once and things like that, it seems like that's the case. But uh, it, it does seem to work for the most part. But like I said, the hitboxes have not been adjusted. I think that would probably require uh, more individual codes, like maybe a code for like Marco's 
uh, ground Muso to have a hitbox and things like that. It seems like that's the case so far. Uh, it's definitely by a case-to-case -case basis, uh, as we saw in this video. Uh, Sanji is definitely <laughs> a much better character, uh, being able to cast all his stuff in, in the midair. Uh, I'll probably test some more characters, maybe off camera or something. But yeah, that's going to do it for me. If you're interested in the, in the cheat engine table, go ahead and check the link in the description, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.